welcome back to Backyard Toy Adventures. We are in a galaxy far, far away. <laughs> well, I guess not too far away. Uh, actually, I spent some time prior to the pandemic with my kids down in uh, Disneyland. And uh, they have a whole new park down there at uh, Batu. They call it Batu West. I guess they have Batu East in Florida, and here in California, they have Batu West. Anyway, we were able to come along and get one of these A number one thermo detonators. And uh, they are giving these out when you buy a drink of Coke or a Sprite. And my, st my son's still trying to procure him himself a new uh, a green one. And I think he might be able to get one in a few a few uh, days. He's going back to Disneyland. And maybe he might be able to get himself one. Anyway, I got mine. <laughs> I like the Coca-Cola one. Anyway, that's what they use um, when Luke, or I'm sorry, when Princess Leia showed up at the cantina in the uh, uh, Star Wars uh, Return of the Jedi. And... Uh, it was pretty cool. I just thought I wanted to, I always wanted to show you that. Anyway, uh, I got my background here of the Mandalorian. Anyway, uh, well, it isn't, this isn't about uh, the child, which is now no longer the child. I guess now they've given him a na name. <laughs> His name is Grogu. <laughs> now try to say that three times backwards. <laughs> anyway, I got uh, Grogu. And I got some of the Mandalorian figures. But this video is not about the Mandalorian himself. Now, uh, the Mandalorian, you know, that's a big thing about him. He, he you know, he doesn't uh, take his helmet off. Anyway, but he's done it a few times in the show. So, anyway, this video is not about the Mandalorian. It's not about Grogu or the child or... Uh, any of the characters beyond this one character I have. And, uh, here she is. This is Cara Dune. And, uh, from what I understand, there are rumors that she may be returning back to the Mandalorian. And, uh, I was trying to find out whether the, it was true or not, but I hope so. I uh, I like the character. I thought I think she's uh, she's a star in the show, and I hope uh, they continue along with her. And uh, I really dig the figure, and that's what it's all about. You know, uh, I don't you know I don't know what she said, and I don't want to know. And uh, all I care is about the show, and uh, the character, and the Star Wars universe, and it takes it should the the show should take you in a galaxy far, far away from what, we, what we're what we dealing with in the real world today. So, that's what it's about. Anyway, so I want you to think about that. And if it makes you, takes you away from all the things that are happening in the world, that's what it's supposed to do. <laughs> anyway, I got this figure to help me do that. And I collect these little figures. And this one is Cara Dune. And let me show you the box art. It's pretty cool. I got a picture over there in the front. And I got a little bit of a write-up here in the back. And that's pretty cool. It says Cara Duna. Cara Dune. <laughs> Cara Dune. Isn't that funny how it's her name is Cara Dune? And it reminds me of the Dune Sea. <laughs> anyway. A veteran of the Galactic Civil War who fought for the Rebellion. Cara Dune is a seasoned, seasoned warrior who has put her days of military discipline behind her and now has reinvented herself as a mercenary along with the Mandalorian. Wow! wow. Shocker cocker! Anyway, <laughs> I really dig this figure. I, you know, I got it maybe a, over a year ago, and I haven't had an opportunity to show it off, but I am going to show it off to you. 
And let me do that. Let me get it opened and uh, get it set up so I can we can take a good old-fashioned look at her. And we'll do that right now. Okay, well, here's actress Gina Carano in her action figure form. And she's got a big heavy blaster. She used to be part of the, the Galactic Empire as a stormtrooper. I believe she was... Uh, She's a heavy infantry. I think she was part of Palpatine's special um, set of stormtroopers. Anyway, she's got a really nice figure, and they did a really good job on, on her face. You can really see the detail that they put in it. Jesus. They do a really good job. They have this special... Um, technique they're using to make these characters, the figures, look so realistic. And uh, wasn't quite like that years ago. They even got her little mark underneath her eye. And uh, did a really good job with that. You can see it right there. They did a really good job. And you can see her, her weapon there. Detail they did on her gauntlets and her belt, and her, the detail they went ahead and did with the with her outfit. I really like that. And her hairpiece, her back. They did a really good job, and did a really good job by painting even with the pins, and they even. This little place to keep her blaster, which is, I'll show you her blaster. You can see it there. And her gun with a blaster and a knife. The detail on it. Did a really good job. That's what they gave her. That's what they gave her. Anyway, you can see how you can turn her head left and right and she can look up that far and down a little bit not too much they didn't give her because of her hair maybe you see her hair is kind of kind of keeps it from turning around oh no it goes all the way 360 degrees I'll take that oh Did her head come all the way off Maybe. Anyway. Anyway, her arm goes up 90 degrees. It's all the way down. She's got to she pivot her arm. Or she's got to swivel at the wrist. And pretty nice. And she can bend her arms pretty good. Lift up her arm pretty good. She's got a bend at the waist and she twists a little bit not too much there hmm. maybe because this belt I'm not too sure anyway you look at the detail they did on her pant you could really her you could see let's see oh her bend at the knee she got there and she's got a little could turn her legs a little bit. She looks like she's got some weapons on her legs there. So, so maybe her she could add her Let's see. Oh yeah, it bends. It's a little tight because it's been in the box for so long. Anyway, that's Gina Carano. The uh Cara Dune character from Star Wars. The Mandalorian. Well, I hope you like my video. Uh, take the time, share it, like it, subscribe, and uh, we'll do. We'll be doing a bit more, and as we go along on our backyard toy adventures, we'll see you next time. May the force be with us all.